A number of the largest hospital groups in the U.S. are dropping COVID-19 vaccine mandates for their staffs to ease labor shortages. Hospitals have been struggling to find workers, including nurses, for years and were even hit harder when the pandemic began. A survey from the CDC in September found 30 percent of workers at more than 2,000 hospitals were unvaccinated. More than half of all U.S. hospitals do not comply with a new pricing transparency rule, according to a new study. Hospitals are required to show the prices for common services, such as colonoscopies and CAT scans, allowing patients to price check before visiting a facility. A study analyzed more than 3,500 hospitals and found 64 percent did not show any pricing data. Researchers say facilities were more likely to show their pricing when other locations in their region shared it as well. Sony is canceling the Dr. Oz show. The heart surgeon and talk show host announced last month he's running as a Republican for a U.S. Senate seat that's about to open in Pennsylvania. TV stations that are seen in Pennsylvania have already taken Dr. Oz off the air, worrying that the FCC's equal time rules would allow rival candidates to ask for similar airtime. A rare, massive gemstone is being called the world's largest blue sapphire. A gem company in Sri Lanka unveiled the one and a half million carat blue sapphire weighing 683 pounds. When it goes up for auction, a gem expert says it could bring $100 million. Bringing your TV with you isn't confined to your phone anymore. LG has developed the Stand By Me TV, which is attached to a stand that can be wheeled around. The 27-inch detachable screen can run wirelessly on battery power. It'll be available sometime next year. There you go, five things to know before you go to bed.